some of that heavy rain is really already beginning to move into our river counties, and that's where we're going to find uh, meteorologist John Conway. He is in lightning right now, and John, uh, what's it like out there where you are? Well, very appropriately, we're in a vehicle named Lightning because as we made our way from Jackson out here to the Mississippi River, in fact, right now we're on uh, U.S. Route 61 just south of Port Gibson, we have seen several cloud-to-ground lightning bolts. Other than that, we haven't seen a whole lot. On the radar, it looks like the heaviest rain making its way across the Mississippi River is up to the north in our Delta counties. Down here south of Vicksburg, we've just been seeing some stray showers as we look out the front uh, window here. Probably see a few of those raindrops on the window. We haven't encountered any heavy rain yet yet, uh, but right now we haven't seen that lightning out there, and the lightning, of course, is a hazard. Lightning can cause uh, structure fires as well as wildfires as well. Now, we're at the very, very beginning of the storm as we looked off to the west. Um, there were those um, severe thunderstorm and tornado warnings in Louisiana off in Texas. That uh, activity is going to be moving in our direction, and Storm Team 12 is going to be here all through the next uh, 12 to 24 hours, uh, tracking this uh, next round of severe weather as, as it moves its way into the Magnolia State. We're reporting live from lightning just south of Port Gibson in Claiborne County. Back to you in the studio.